refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up about it. Uh, it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt rings. Right, the bouncer's guilt rings. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day. Tell us how it felt to be back. <laughs> I mean, it hasn't been that long this time. But well, yeah, well, I mean, last time I was back, what, well, it was January? Yeah. Yeah, man. Maybe it's, it's, yeah, yeah, well, I'm, it's like, I'm it's a professional. Life, it's, uh, <laughs> this is what we do. Yeah, yeah, well, I mean, it's... Full fight in uh, seven months. It hasn't even been a year since Misfits started in August. We've already done, what? Seven incredible events. Remember the home video on the Sunday? To the yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man, it was wild. But yeah, you know, today it was a tough test. You know, me against Joe Fournier. You know, he had the experience on me. And, you know, as soon as I hit him with a few couple shots, I just knew, like, he, like, gave me the eyes when he was like, oh, wow. So at that point, he was very standoffish. And that's where I was able to really just close him down. and. Uh, short the distance, and then the second round I came through with that overhand the shot that he said I wouldn't be able to land on him. Came through with it, and then from then on, he, he, he was like trying to grab me for dear life, trying to just hold me, just trying to figure out where he was, and then from then on, it was him, right, boom, and that was it. Did you? You've obviously had some, you know, some everyone against the ring, as I said before. Uh, your opponents before have always been abandoned opponents. Um, and no disrespect to Pineda, you know, it's a different sort of a, a pro boxer, let's say. This tonight was your first one that was a proper professional boxer. Proper, proper test. So did, did you yeah. notice that when you were trying to find that range um, with the in and out, did you, did you find it? I mean, obviously it didn't take too long, but, but was yeah. it different? What was different about the... Well, I, 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 just, I just realized he didn't let me do what I wanted to do, so I was like, okay, I'm going to have to try a different plan. So, yeah, I think you might have seen me do a few switch steps um, and also just try to, like, do a few double-doubles. I don't this probably means nothing to you, but, like, in my head, like, just to cross over my legs, go into the South Pole and try some stuff. And then... Uh, yeah, you know, I went back to the basics, just the overhand, and it was just there, it was open. He just left it, left his head there for that massive shot, and then that just fully rocked him. And at that point, he was just trying to survive. He was in survival mode, and, and uh, yeah, that's all she wrote. And tell me something, I've done, I don't know, I've promoted in Wembley Arena for probably for about 20 years, and yeah. I've never seen a main event warm up. Uh, True, the other card and the loading bay. Yeah! Was that, was that a preparation for what was to come well, later in the evening? Or what were you actually doing? <laughs> well, the the funny thing is, <laughs> so I was, I was telling Alexis. I, like, like I, I, I was telling Alexis, bro, well, we've never done this before. And he was like, yeah, yeah, we did the last, the last um, fight. And I was like, no, we definitely did. But then I was like, alright, well, we, we started doing it. And bro, everyone started showing up with the cameras. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 but yeah, yeah, we, you know, we're more of the right. First I've ever seen. Yeah, we want to. Well, yeah, man, I, I, I did my thing. I felt fresh, I felt alive, I felt ready, man. And, you know, even with the, the two, what, one, two shots that he hit me with, I just hit them. And I was like, yeah, yeah, bro, this, this guy can't do anything to me. Because I just know how hard I train, you know, in camp. How, you know, the people I spar with, you know, it's at such a high level, so. Yeah, for me, I just know whenever I touch you, you're going to sleep. We obviously saw... Uh because I refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I never shut up about it. Uh, it must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt rings. Right, the bouncer's guilt rings. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day. 